The scaled composites model 348 White Knight II (WK2) is a quadjet cargo aircraft that is used to lift the Spaceship II spacecraft to release altitude. It was developed by Scaled Composites from 2007 to 2010 as the first stage of Tier 1B, A2 stage to suborbital space manned launch system. WK-2 is based on the successful mothership to spaceship own, White Knight, which itself is based on Proteus. With an open architecture design and explicit plans for multi-purpose use, the aircraft could also operate as a zero-g aircraft for passenger training or microgravity science flights, handle missions in high-altitude testing more generally, or be used to launch payloads other than Spaceship 2. A study of use of the aircraft as a forest fire water bomber has also been mentioned, one that would utilize a large carbon composite water tank that could be quickly replenished to make repeat runs over fires. Virgin Galactic has ordered two White Knight 2 vehicles. Together, WK 2 and SS 2 form the basis for Virgin Galactic's fleet of suborbital space planes. In November 2010, the spaceship company had announced that it planned to build at least three additional White Knight II aircraft and an additional five Spaceship II rocket planes, the aircraft to be built by Virgin after the initial prototypes of each craft are built by scaled composites. As of 2015, it is not clear how many SS-2 and WK-2 vehicles will actually be built. The first White Knight II is named VMS Eve after Richard Branson's mother Eve Branson. It was officially unveiled on July 28, 2008, and flew for the first time on December 21, 2008. The second is expected to be named VMS Spirit of Steve Fawcett after Branson's close friend Steve Fawcett, who died in an aircraft accident in 2007. Topic: History. During 2012 to 2014, Virgin Galactic was also considering use of the White Knight II as the air launch platform for a new two-stage liquid-fueled rocket small satellite launcher called Launcherown. In the event, by late 2015, they decided to use a larger carrier aircraft for the job. Topic. Design White Knight 2 is roughly three times larger than White Knight in order to perform a captive flight with the larger Spaceship 2 spacecraft. The WK-2 is similar in wingspan to a Boeing B-29 Superfortress. White Knight 2 is a very modern aircraft, as even the flight control cables are constructed of carbon fiber. Using a new patented design, WK 2 will provide preview flights offering several seconds of weightlessness before the suborbital event. It is intended to have a service ceiling of about 60,000 feet, 18 kilometers, offering a dark blue sky to passengers. This will allow tourists to practice before the real flight. White Knight 2 is of twin fuselage design with four jet engines mounted two on each wing. One fuselage is an exact replica of that of Spaceship 2 to allow tourist training, and the other will offer cut rate trips to the stratosphere. The design is quite different from the White Knight, both in size, use of tail, engine configuration, and placement of cockpits. The White Knight uses two T-tails, but the White Knight 2 uses two cruciform tails. Engine configuration is also very different. White Knight 2 has four engines hung underneath the wings on pylons while White Knight's pair of engines are on either side of its single fuselage. <laughs> Topic. Timeline of introduction Virgin Galactic contracted aerospace designer Bert Rutan to build the mothership and spacecraft. On January 23, 2008, the White Knight 2 design was revealed. 
On July 28, 2008 the completion and rollout of the first aircraft, EVE, tail number, N348MS occurred at Scaled's Mojave headquarters. Branson predicted that the maiden space voyage would take place in 18 months. It represents the chance for our ever-growing group of future astronauts and other scientists to see our world in a completely new light." On March 22, 2010 the VMS EVE completed its 25th flight, the first occasion it carried the spaceship to, VSS Enterprise. In a flight of 2 hours 54 minutes, it ascended to an altitude of 45,000 feet 14, meters. The launch customer of White Knight 2 is Virgin Galactic, which will have the first two units, and exclusive rights to the craft for the first few years. <laughs> <laughs> Flight test program An extensive flight test program of VMS EVE, with nearly 20 flights between December 2008 and August 2009, was undertaken to validate the design and gradually expand the aircraft operating envelope. The flight tests were complete by September 2009, and testing with Spaceship 2 began in early 2010. Topic aircraft specifications Data from Virgin Galactic Presentation 2007 General Characteristics Crew two Flight Crew plus Spaceship Launch Crew Capacity, Payload 17,000 kg pounds to 50,000 feet 15,000 meters, 200 kg satellite to LEO when carrying a launcher own orbital launch vehicle. Length 78 feet 9 in 24 meters wingspan 141 feet 1 in 43 meters power plant 4 times Pratt and Whitney Canada PW308 turbofan engines 6900 lbf 30 69 kilonewtons thrust each performance service ceiling 70000 feet 21000 meters Topic. See also Scaled Composites Proteus, predecessor to White Nightone White Nightone, predecessor to White Nightu Scaled Composites Stratolaunch Rock, derivative of White Nightu Launcherone, payload for White Nightu